Welcome to the Kingston Robotics Lab, a 10,000 square foot space that was recently created by the Machine Mavericks, who are now in their fourth year of robotics competition. They are working together with another team, Lake Effect, who won the 2018 World Championships in Detroit. This space is now home to six area robotics teams. The teams range from grade school teams competing with three pound Lego robots to high school teams competing with 120 pound robots. At every level, the teams are given roughly two months to build a robot to accomplish certain tasks, and then spend the next two months competing against other teams from their own area, from across the province, and from around the world. Everyone involved in this activity loves what they're doing and is working to grow the sport, and there is plenty of room for growth. We have a handful of robotics teams here, but in the Windsor area, for example, there are 40 teams within 20 miles of each other. Starting or joining soccer or hockey teams in this area is pretty straightforward. There are already local leagues, soccer fields, hockey arenas, and so on. That has not been the case for robotics, and that's what we hope to change. The goal of the space is to help grow robotics in this area. When they first started, the Machine Mavericks ran into problems that teams everywhere face on a regular basis. These included how to find space to build and practice, how to get access to a machine shop, where to buy parts and how to pay for them. The Mavericks saw an opportunity for a space that could work like the startup incubators popular in high-tech areas such as Silicon Valley, Waterloo and Research Triangle Park. They worked to create a shared space that provided the basics that all teams need. Practice areas, computers, CAD workstations, a machine shop, and access to technical advisors and mentors. Having this space allows teams to work together on shared problems and compete based on what makes them different. The teams in this area are looking for more members, and together we are looking for more teams. We see no reason that there couldn't be 10 times as many teams and participants as there are now. You might think that people need math or science backgrounds to participate in these, but that's simply not true. Each team involved in this is essential. Its own small business and success coming from managing all the functions that any business has managed. Developing a business plan, getting funding, managing projects, doing effective branding, marketing and recruiting, as well as developing the skills of their participants. If you got any skills in the area at all, we could probably use them. Even if you don't, we can help you develop them. Most students on these teams come in knowing very little about how all this works. During the off-season, they get an idea of what the areas of specialization are and can choose activities that are most interesting to them. Those who work on the robots learn how to take an idea from a paper sketch to a CAD model to a finished product produced by computer-controlled mills, lays, printers, and so on. During competition season, they do all this while working closely under tight deadlines. The students working on the business side learn how to create a business plan, how to raise money, how to manage finances, how to create a brand, and how to grow the organization. During the competition season, they make presentations for judged awards related to business models, community involvement, safety programs, and so on. We hope that this facility will drive interest in robotics that will last for years to come. If you're interested and want to get involved, you can reach us through machinemavericks.com.